Hello, 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 good afternoon, good morning, good evening, good day, wherever you're joining me from. Uh, it's a great privilege to have you here. I appreciate you. I appreciate everyone joining me this moment. Uh, Irene Charles is it the FBI coach. FBI stands for Financial and Business Intelligence Coach. It's a wonderful opportunity I have uh, having you here. Rather, it's um, I don't make light of the uh, opportunity to have you view my videos, to watch me share with you uh, from my wealth of knowledge. I do not make light of that. I appreciate every one of you. Um, welcome, please tell me where you're being from in the comment section. Kindly drop uh, where you're being from and also share the link with as many as you know. I'm currently sharing it on other platforms I belong. Uh, please share in the comment section. Um, if you are watching live, put it in the comment section, hashtag live. And uh, if you're watching a replay, kindly type hashtag replay. It's going to be a great time this moment. It's actually afternoon where I am, um, right in the city of Pitakwa in Nigeria. Um, I, I, I'm committed to seeing you get better. I'm committed to seeing you... Uh, make a lot of money from whatever you do. That's why I do a lot of uh, uh, stuff in the area of personal development, in the area of um, growing your finances, in the area of um, managing your business, developing your skills. You know, one key thing I, I tell everybody that in this era, what keeps you ahead of others is the skill which you have. You know, I have often said that if you want more, you need to be more. If you want to earn more, you need to be more. You need to, you need to develop your mental capacity. You need to develop your inner values. You need to develop your, your inner structure. You know, and that inner structure can never get better than what it is if you have not expanded it someone once said to me child i have gotten to my um i have reached my elastic limit you know but, but i say to people you you haven't stretched yourself one bit you haven't you haven't you know if the likes of uh jeff bezos if the likes of um uh richard branson are going to the space <laughs> you know then we haven't started. Richard Branson is in his 70s and he was the first man to move to the space in a commercial way and come back. You know, and he has given opportunity. There's something he's doing currently. He's giving opportunity to as many as would want to go to the space. So you can visit uh, Richard Branson's uh, world. Well, he's not paying me for advert, but he's one of my mentors. He's someone I have followed for years. I love his entrepreneur zeal i love his entrepreneur strategies i love what he do for humanity and um and i'm also following suit it is said that when you do what other successful people did you get the same results which they got so if you want to be a millionaire you need to work with the millionaires okay so today uh, we'll be sharing something profound, something that has made a lot of people not achieve the millionaire status. Either millionaire in Naira, millionaire in Cedes, millionaire in Rands, millionaire in Euro, pound sterling, dollars, whatever currency it is. If you have not done these few things I'm going to share with you, you can't hit the millionaire status. You can't. It's not a rocket science. See, haven't you wondered why those who win, um, uh, what's it called, um, lottery, haven't you wondered why after a period of time, they go back to square one, they go back to the level they used to be, sometimes worse than the level they used to be. Haven't you wondered why? Because a few things are missing. A fool and his money are soon parted. 
Okay, so I need you to stay with me. Now, number four is my catch point. I love number four point. So if you stay with me, you would know this number four. And I also want you to put up in the comment section at the end of the training, which of the points resonates with you. So today, we're going to be learning something um, I have put together over a period of time, something I have learned. And um, it's something I have practiced. Uh, so I'm going to share it with you today. Reasons why you are not yet a millionaire. Today we'll be looking at reasons why you are not yet a millionaire. First, who is a millionaire? A millionaire is someone who ends in seven figures. Even when you remove a penny from his money, he still ends in seven figures. Okay? A millionaire is... now. There, there is no straight jacket to this definition because somebody else can come up and say to me, Charles, a millionaire is not someone who is wealthy in cash, but a millionaire is someone who is wealthy in knowledge. I agree with you in a point, but he's not really a millionaire. Someone who is, um, uh, someone is wealthy uh, for, because, of course, money starts from your mind. You need to develop your mind. You need to accept the fact that you must develop your mind. Okay, so by the time we go through this, these five reasons you are not yet a millionaire, you understand why I have been able, why I, I've put this together to help a lot of people get out of that bottleneck of not being a millionaire. So if you are ready, type in the comment section, I am ready. Let's hit the road. If you are ready, Put it up in the comment section. I, FBI coach, I am ready. Yes, I am ready. Let's hit the road. By the way, uh, I appreciate my returning subscribers. I appreciate every one of you. Now, if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please subscribe to the channel and also activate the notification button so that anytime I put up any valuable content, you will be first to get the notification. You'll be notified immediately and you hook up. See, um, then uh, I also want you to like this video and I want you to share it with as many as you can. Share it on your different social media platforms. Let's be a blessing wholesale. Let's help other people get out of this bottleneck of not hitting the millionaire status. It's easy to hit the millionaire status. As a matter of fact, it is more difficult to become poor than to become wealthy. I'll say that again. It is more difficult to become poor than to become wealthy. To be wealthy, it's easier in our present time. Okay? So, let's move on. You are not yet a millionaire because, number one, you have not decided to become a millionaire. You have not decided to become a millionaire. For you to be a millionaire, you must first of all decide, make up your mind that, yes, I, Charles, is a FBI coach. I want to be a millionaire. If you have, see, I, I, I tell people, as long as it has not been conceived in your mind, it will not enter your hand. I'll say that again. Whatever you have not vividly imagined and you have not thought about, enthusiastically act upon, you can't get it. It will inevitably not come to pass. Okay? So most people I know, they dream, they fantasize to be a millionaire, but only a few attain that status. Why? Because... They only think, uh, 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 they only think, oh, that man is a millionaire. They only wish, but they have not taken the decision to become a millionaire. You need to decide. Now, let me, let me share an illustration. You know, uh, um, assuming uh, you want to be a medical doctor, you cannot just wish being a medical doctor. There is a process to becoming a medical doctor. And the first thing you need to do is to, first of all, decide that I want to go to school to study medicine. And having decided, you buy the necessary forms to get enrolled in the university. So it requires a process. 
So I, I cannot just wake up and say, um, I cannot just wake up and say, I'm a medical doctor. It doesn't happen like that. Every great venture, every great person you see today achieve that status because they first decided, they made up their mind. Your spirit, soul, and body must align, must come in sync that I want to achieve this status. And the beautiful thing about making up your mind to become a millionaire is the fact that once you make up your mind, you kill your excuses. Excuses are the tools of the incompetence. They are monuments of nothingness. And they are tools only used by fools. Only fools use excuses. Excuses are more deadlier than Ebola. Excuses are more deadlier than COVID-19. Excuses are more deadlier than cancer. It eats the fabric of everything that has to do with you. So you must deal with your excuses. When you take the right decision to become a millionaire, you kill your excuses. Okay? You kill your excuses. If you're waiting to become a millionaire by chance, I'm sorry to let you know that you are wasting time. You're wasting time. So when you, when you decide to become a millionaire, you have to invest in yourself. You will need to invest in your intellectual property. Like I said earlier, wealth, first of all, starts from your mind. Wealth starts from your mind. When wealth comes from your mind, it will then move to your hand. From your hand, it will come into your pocket. You must make up your mind. Tell yourself today, I am making up my mind that I will be a millionaire. By December 31st, 2021, you must set a measurable timeline. So the first step is that you need to get out of that bottleneck of, oh, um, I, I wonder when my miracle will happen. The miracle is already in your hands. God has equipped you with everything that pertains unto good life and godliness. Everything it requires for you to be a millionaire, God has equipped you with it. God has given it to you. It, 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 it will not fall upon you like a bag of sherry. So you need to invest in yourself. You need to invest in your knowledge. You need to invest in intellectual property. You need to start embarking on trainings. You need to start reading books. I have said this repeatedly and I will say it again because it bears repetition. There is a school that does not require, that does not go on strike. That school does not require you buying handouts. That school does not require, uh, you will not experience uh, lecturer victimization. And that school is called the University of YouTube. You need to maximize YouTube. The only thing needed of you, expected of you from YouTube is your data and ability to sit down to learn. And, and some of you think, oh, I, I, I'm to, to watch YouTube videos, I, I'm going to spend a lot. But funny, to, funny enough, you don't, you don't spend much data on YouTube. Now, if you're in Nigeria, you will discover that the service providers in this country, uh, they give you free data for YouTube night. Night browsing on YouTube, you, 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 you have access to this data from 11 p.m., to 6 a.m. Please, I want to beg you, stop sleeping all night. Stop sleeping all night. Even if it's just an hour you spend on YouTube from that 11 p.m. to 12 midnight every day for the next 30 days, you come back, buy one cow that has only two teeth with two tail to say, FBI coach, thank you. There's so much to learn from YouTube. So much. And don't just go on YouTube and, and be winding away time. You must have something you are studying. You must be specific. For example, I want to study on making money online. Go on YouTube. Search making money online. You see several videos, both the good, the bad, the ugly. You see several videos. So it's not left for you to see what you uh, want to watch. But just to give you a guide, watch Dunlock videos. Watch Les Brown videos. Watch Brian Tracy videos. Watch FBI coach videos. Watch Tony Robbins videos. Watch McHarvey's. There are so many of them. Even, even uh, Jim Ron of Blessed Memory. His videos are on YouTube. Watch their videos. 
okay watch um simon sinek's videos watch grant cardon videos just pick up a topic dissect the topic and you will be amazed the things you will get several years back i i spend uh, like six hours on youtube every day i spent like six hours watching different videos it developed me so after reading the books in my library i go to my youtube i pick up the same topic on what i have read i go to youtube i search for it so it helps me put the readings together for example i i, I read a book on um how to sell for example or like this one by simon sinek start with start with the why okay i read this book i go on the youtube i search for videos that has to do with starting with the why it helps me to internalize the things i have learned it helps me to get better get the you know when you chew when you eat meat for example you eat chicken meat the bone when you when you crack the bone there is juice <laughs> i'll use the word juice there is juice in the bone it's called the bone marrow the taste is yummy now that's what you get after reading a book and you go on youtube to search the same topic you are eating you are sucking the marrow in the bone so you need to invest in yourself it's very important a man who does not read good books is as good as a man who does not read at all it's not enough to read but you must read the right books okay if you are not if you are if you're waiting to become a millionaire by chance please wake up you are only dreaming wake up and smell the coffee there is no overnight success i'll say that again there is no overnight success the success you see today is a combination of all the efforts put together. I'm not saying miracles doesn't happen. Miracle happens, but it rarely happens. And God expects us not to live our lives on miracles, but on his covenant. And what's God's covenant for us? God's covenant for you and I is that we live in health, we live in prosperity, and we be a blessing to our generation. We live in health. We live in prosperity and we be a blessing to our generation. Now, how do you become a blessing to your generation when you are not a blessing to yourself? How? It's, it's, it, you discover it's not possible. First, you need to be a blessing to yourself. Then you now extend to your immediate family before you move to the outer world. Okay? Yeah, there is no overnight success. There is no overnight success. So if you are dreaming of becoming wealthy by chance, please wake up. I am I am what I am to I am what I am today. One by the grace of God, two by maximizing the giftings of God in me. God has deposited gifts in everybody. God see the ability to become a millionaire, the gifts, the strategies. The qualities, everything to become a millionaire is already in you. But you have not activated it. You are not yet in that cadre. You have not yet achieved that status because you are yet to activate it. You need to quit the blame game. You need to stop blaming others for your misfortune. You need to stop blaming others for your inadequacies. And you need to stop justifying why you are poor. Or why you are broke. You need to stop justifying why things aren't working well for you. Then you should stop comparison. Stop comparing yourself with others. It's very important. Stop comparing yourself with others. So there is no overnight success. You can't become a millionaire by chance. It requires deliberate efforts. Deliberate activities you need to do. Number two. You have not taken the right action to become a millionaire. It is one thing to decide to be a millionaire. It's another thing to take the right steps, to take the right action. So the question is, what's the next step? I have decided I want to be a millionaire. What's the next step? I have decided I want to be a medical doctor. What's the next step? 
what do I need to do to become a millionaire? You know, uh, um, a young guy came to me sometime and said to me, um, he wants to be a millionaire. And I said to him, what do you want to do to be a millionaire? He said, he doesn't know. I said to him, then, are you willing to pay the price to be a millionaire? He said he's willing to do it. I, and I said to him that, look, I'm not asking you to go and meet one babalawo and all that. So what I did was I gave him a simple task. I gave him a book. I told him to read that book, finish that book in 10 days. Summarize the book. Come back to me with the summary. This happened sometime in uh, November last year. As we speak, <laughs> 10 days is yet to complete. I haven't seen the guy. 10 days is yet to complete. See, people just, some people, they just want overnight success and it doesn't happen. That's why the Ponzi schemes are eating a lot of people's money because they just want to fold their hands and expect everything to be falling upon them like a bag of sherry. It doesn't work that way. You need to take the right steps. You want to be a medical doctor? Have it at the back of your mind that becoming a millionaire i need to take the right steps so what are these right steps you need to take i have mentioned before that you need to invest in yourself you need to read the right books then you need to start asking yourself some questions what type of business would I like to, to go into? Now, the businesses I do are not the same type of business which you will do. So you ask yourself, what type of business do I want to do? Now, for me, I, I am, I'm into network marketing and digital products. And I ask myself, how do I learn the rudiments of this business so I can become an expert at it? And the answer is simple. By attending seminars, by paying for online trainings, by paying for offline trainings, by reading books, by following experts in the topic, in the area of my interest. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a guru in network marketing because I'm following seven-figure earners in network marketing. I'm doing well in my digital trainings, in my digital selling my digital products because I'm following seven-figure earners who are making most of the seven uh, 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 digital platform you want to go into um you want to go into e-commerce you need to learn the rudiments now without shadow of doubt or without fear of or intimidation i'm recommending my high income skill training to you it's a very good place to start paraventure you don't know what to do you don't know where to start my high income skill training will jumpstart you. It will, it, will, it will sow the seed of inspiration in you. It will generate ideas from on the inside of you. You start doing business where there was no business. My high income skill training is from the 1st to 15th of every month. So that of August is starting tomorrow, being the 1st of August. If you haven't registered, there is a link in this video okay that will tell you more about my high income skill training click on the link in this video and um, you will be able to learn a lot how you can maximize this platform so you, you need to uh, uh, have to go on trainings then you also ask yourself how profitable is this business it's not enough to get into any business you also need to find out the profitability there are different vehicles that will lead you to financial freedom there are different vehicles to financial freedom. Trekking is a vehicle. If you are trekking from Lagos to Port Harcourt, 
I, I don't know how many weeks or months it will take you to get to your destination. But two things are bound to happen. You can either get there safely or something happens on the way. The next vehicle is three circle, which we call KK. If you want to get to Port Harcourt from Lagos, you drive your KK. I don't know how many weeks or how many months it will take you to get there. But two things are bound to happen. They will either will lay you on the way or you get to your destination safely. If you want to go with a Range Rover Sport, the 2021 model, car buyer, hey, whenever I think of that, did I say 2021? 2022 model. Go and Google it. Go and look for that vehicle. That vehicle is a game changer. Range Rover Sport 2022 model. You want to get from, you want to travel from Lagos to Port Harcourt with Range Rover Sports. Within hours, you'll get there. Okay? Two things are bound to happen. You either get there safely or they will lay you on the way and collect your beautiful Range Rover Sport. You decide to go with a private jet within minutes. You are arriving at your destination. Two things are bound to happen. You either take off nicely and land safely or something happens on the airway. Now, what am I trying to say? Whichever vehicle you choose, there is risk involved. So you need to have this at the back of your mind. Any business, they tell you there is no risk. Oh, this one is risk-free. Please and please run for your dear life. Run for your dear life. There is risk. There is price to pay for any great thing you want to achieve. Okay? So you, you, you need to decide which vehicle. So I ask myself, how profitable is the business? Is the business? And the answer is that many people are making millions from it. So I should be able to make the millions as well. Then the next question I asked myself was, how solid is the business model? How solid is the business model? And I, I had to remind myself that, yes, the business model is fantastic. It's an amazing one. So I plugged in. Then the next question I asked myself was, can I afford this startup? Ladies and gentlemen, if you cannot afford the startup of your desired level, move to something that you can afford. That's why my high income skill training is seriously subsidized. The reason why I subsidized my high income skill training is not because of the money I want to make from the people who registered. Of course, I have the clients where I make this five, six, seven figures from. But the general high income skill training is geared towards a vision. And that vision is to ensure 10 million families are financially free by 2025. It's a five-year goal plan. We are in 2021 already, four more years to go. And I want to have you as one of those who will be financially free in that goal. That's why I'm giving more use value than cash value. That's why I give out my all. I give more than you pay for. My high income skill training is about $3 or thereabout, about 5,000 Naira. And what you get is worth over $100. It's worth over 50. It's, it's so, did I say $100? It's worth over $300. If you doubt me, give it a try. And if you don't make what you have, uh, 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 your, your registration fee, I give you back your money and I write an apology letter for you. That's my cashback guarantee. So the link is in this, in this video. You will see the link to participate in my high income skill training. So you need to ask yourself these questions. How do I participate? What are the, what, who are those making money from this business? How can I grow? Okay. Number three reason you are not yet a millionaire. You take bad financial advice. You take bad financial advice. Who is your advisor? Who is your mentor? Who speaks into your life in the area of money? Whose advice do you take? Uh, um, this play out in our society a lot. I, I see some people, they want to get into a business. They, they don't ask 
um, a, a, a financial expert, a financial advisor, what they think about a business. Just because Mama and Kechi is doing the business, she's making money, she, you quickly dash into it. Oh, they say that thing is paying, but he's paying, he's paying people. Excuse me for the fact that he's paying people. Doesn't make it legal. There are so many Ponzi schemes that crashed towards the end of last year. And they left a lot of people in disarray. Some persons committed suicide. Why? Because they took wrong financial advice. They took wrong financial advice. When you have issues with your car, who do you go to see? You go to see an automobile expert. When you have issues with your health, who do you see? You see what? A medical personnel. So why is it that when you want to take financial decisions, you don't consult a financial expert? Don't just take financial decisions. The reason why people have lost money is because they take wrong decisions from the wrong set of people. You can imagine a medical doctor going to a shoemaker, a shoe cobbler, to ask him how he can become the best medical doctor in town. That's an error. Please, I need you to type in the comment section, error 101. I want to see it in the comment section, error 101. Or um, uh, an automobile engineer go to a scavenger to ask the scavenger, how can I be the best motor mechanic in town? <laughs> Error 101. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. So you must, if you want to be a millionaire, you need to take advice from a financial expert. I've been able to build myself, okay? I've been able to develop myself over the years. I've been an entrepreneur for over 16 years. I've been a, this entrepreneurial uh, uh, field. I understand what it means to lose millions, millions within seconds, without millions within hours from one transaction. And I also understand what it means to earn millions from business transactions. I have done transactions with so many cognomerates. I have set up businesses that are running here and there that are on autopilot. Without shadow of doubt, I, I, I consider myself to have, I know my onions and I'm chopping my suya. <laughs> I tell people, if you know your onions, you will eat your suya, okay? So don't take advice from the wrong set of people. Don't take advice from the wrong set of people for the fact that he's working for Mr. A doesn't make it legal. You need to ask questions. And not just asking questions, ask the right people the right questions at the right time. Taking good financial advice saves you from wonder banks. It saves you from Ponzi schemes. It saves you from things that looks like network marketing, but they are not network marketing. There are so many pyramid schemes. There are so many Ponzi schemes that come up. They say, okay, we are um, an e-commerce and they flag one thing or the other you need to take good advice. You need to scrutinize it very well. Don't just wake up and say, okay, I'm going into this business. Have you taken your time to uh, uh, study the uh, business plan? Have you taken your time to study the compensation plan? Have you taken your time to study the in and out of that business? Do your research. You have the Google with you. You have the internet where you can ask questions, okay? That's why when I talk about my high income skill, I will always refer people to my Facebook group. Go there and see testimonies, see what people are saying about this training. My training is corrosive, my training is mind shifting, my training is pocket transformational. Without shadow of doubt, it makes you a better person. It's always the best 15 days of your life. Number four, you have only one source of income. Now, this is the point I said I love most. You know why I love it? Because I see a lot of people still play in this field. They have only one income source. And they're not thinking. 
How will I get out of this bottleneck? How will I get out of this quagmire? I've been studying the lives of millionaires about over a decade now. And, I, and one thing I've noticed is that they don't have only one source of income. They practice multiple streams of income. They have multiple income streams. And I'm not denying the fact that there are some people that are rich despite having only one source of income. You know, uh, take for instance, you can you can become rich by playing football you know, the, in the premiership and, and they, play, they pay you a lot of money. The problem is that such opportunity doesn't happen all the time. And when the 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 you have injury in your in your in your on your leg rather you discover that the source of income will start dwindling what you used to earn you will not earn again because no coach would want to pay you for what you have not played no company so the simple is start a business start a business What's the business you need to start? Start a, a side hustle. You have a job, start a side, side hustle. You have a business, start another business. You don't have a business, learn business, learn skills. Learn skills. Don't be, don't see one income stream, one income stream, I beg your pardon, is like a man who is sitting on, um, sitting with. One, a, a chair that has only one leg that is not balanced is a suicide mission. You need multiple skills and not just anyhow skills. You need high income skills. You need skills that will push you ahead of others. That's why I always recommend my high income skill training because it's corrosive. My high income skill training it will 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 jumpstart you as long as you follow, you do the activities, you do the assignments, you do, because all these activities is for your own good. You're not doing it for me. And you do all these things. You see yourself sorry. So start a, a side hustle. It's very important. It's very important. You start a side hustle. Start a business. Now, I, I'm going to share with you um, the a few side hustles you can start 10 best side hustles you can start that can make you seven figures every month number one be a copywriter copywriter simply means salesman in print copywriter is that person that will put up write-ups that will make people buy whatever he's selling you know when you're scrolling on social media sometimes you come across write-ups and you pause you read the write-up before you know what's happening you are done reading, reading the write-up and you click on learn more to take you to their sales funnel. It's a product of a copywriter. That's one of the things you will learn in my high income skill training. Learn crypto and forex trading. Learn how to trade it. Don't just give money to anybody to start trading for you. Learn the rudiments. Learn what it means to trade on forex. Learn uh, uh, different types of candles. How to uh, uh, read your candles. You know, learn different strategies. Learn different strategies on Forex trading, crypto trading. Learn affiliate marketing. Affiliate marketing is also one of the things you learn on my high income skill training. Affiliate marketing simply means you are selling another person's product. You don't own the shop. You don't own the product. You are only a linkage, a middleman. Let me use the word a middleman. Connecting the buyer to the seller. You make your profit. That's what affiliate marketing means. Some people are making uh, uh, close to three, four, five million every month. It depends on your vibe. It depends on your speed. It depends on your passion. There is so much money to make from affiliate marketing. But before you delve into affiliate marketing, registry with any company, go through a training. Learn what affiliate marketing is all about. My high income skill training is a very perfect place to get you started. Number four, join a network marketing company. <coughs> Excuse me. The benefit of network marketing company is the fact that it doesn't affect whatever you're doing. It, 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 it does not have any infringement on your business. 
you are doing you are you have your paid job you can still run your site network marketing business as a side hustle or you have a business you are doing currently network marketing will also add flavor to it and another benefit of network marketing is the fact that you learn um marketing skills you learn closing skills you learn uh, negotiation skills you learn public speaking skills you learn people management skills le <clears throat> leadership skills so many skills you can think of you learn all that from network marketing it makes you become a better person then number five you can start start youtubing start making money from your youtube making money from youtube is easy the first thing you need to do, learn know about making money from youtube you must have accumulated minimum of four thousand hours watch time in a year if all your videos has accumulated minimum of four thousand hours watch time youtube then you need to register with the youtube uh, uh ad uh, adsense and you, and they start paying you how does that work they place adverts on your videos you know sometimes you're watching some videos on youtube you see adverts will pop up those people are being paid and the longer your your videos uh the better because if your video is less than five minutes youtube will not place advert on it good advert good videos that pay you uh, you you end between uh you see yourself earning between three to ten dollars per video the longer the video the more ads they will place and the more ads they place on it the more money you make there's money in youtube okay you you can just be sharing videos on the things you love and when you're sharing things about youtube don't make it about yourself share other people's videos as well share valuable content like i am doing right now okay then number six sell information or digital products my high income skill training is all about digital products my high income skill training will teach you how to come up with your digital products there is a book i give out on my high income skill training uh it's called 20 digital products you can start that book if you read if you take your time and read that book there is no way you will ever be poor again and following everything i teach you on my high income skill training there is no way you can ever be broke again because ideas and how to put those ideas to work will spring up from the inside of you you are making money with your smartphone then number seven, become an Instagram influencer. You can, you can teach people how to grow their Instagram account. Now, there is a training I'm coming up with. It's going to be a low ticket offer training, how to grow your Instagram account and how you can also make money teaching people how to grow their Instagram account. You can make money being an Instagram influencer. There are so many Instagram influencers. What do people do? They place adverts on their, on their, uh, profile and they start making money then offer virtual assistance i have a friend who is a virtual uh, secretary she does virtual secretary to people a virtual assistant could be managing people's uh, uh, ads facebook ads youtube ads uh, google ads uh, and there are so many things you can do as a virtual assistant be a graphic designer you can learn graphics. Canva is a, a very wonderful place to learn graphics. Okay? You can learn graphics. You can also learn to become a video editor using your smartphone. I edit my videos using my smartphone. Then number 10, you can get a part-time job. So these are the 10 main side hustles you can start. You can start up these side hustles with your smartphone and you are making money for yourself with your smartphone sometimes the trainings i offer i'm putting on singlet and my boxers crossing my leg on my bed and the training is going on some of the trainings are automated i'm not even present maybe i'm sleeping and my and my um um boat is doing the work for me sometimes some people think charles is physically there i wasn't there these are strategies we have come to learn in the digital world. Even some of my videos, I, I schedule them. I'm going to run a training. Uh, one of these days, I'm going to do a free training on YouTube, how you can schedule your posts. You can schedule posts 
as far as next week, next month. You can schedule posts every day. You don't have to be physically there to make posts on your social media. You must learn to free yourself. Enjoy time freedom. You are doing whatever you're doing. Your posts are going out. Your videos are going out. I'm going to do a training on that, free training on that. So get ready to learn more from me, okay? Because uh, we are on this journey together, the journey to transform life, all right? Number five, you are not yet a millionaire because you don't have anybody to push you. You don't have anybody to push you. Who is your mentor? Who are you following? Who is speaking into your life? Who is in your inner circle? Do you have an inner circle? As a matter of fact, do you understand what it means to have an inner circle? The fact that you have a ten dollars number on your phone is a privilege. But when a ten dollar has your number on his phone, it is connection. I'll say that again. You have a ten dollars number on your phone. It's a privilege that you got that number in the first place. But that a ten dollar have your number stored on his phone is a connection. Who are you connected with? Who speaks into your life? Who is your mentor? Who do you call your mentor? Why do you call that person your mentor? Why do you call that person your role model? I have mentors that speaks into my life. But I don't go to my mentors with terms and conditions. There are so many people that go to their mentors with terms and conditions. I don't go to my mentors with terms and conditions. I don't go to my mentors telling them um, why I have not become whom I want to be. I go to my mentor like a child, ready to learn. And I deposit into my mentor's emotional bank account. What do you, what, what, see, whatever anointing you don't appreciate, whatever anointing you don't cherish, whatever anointing you don't appreciate, you don't appreciate, you don't cherish, you don't, um, you don't reverence, you cannot attract it. It's one of the laws of life. God created this world and made it to be governed on principles. There wouldn't have been any Elisha without Elijah. There wouldn't have been any Joshua without Moses. And there wouldn't have been any Peter, Paul, or the apostles without Jesus. Who is your mentor? Who speaks into your life? Whose lines are you, who, whose precepts are you following? Who are you emulating? Who is pushing you to success? I'm going to share a story with you at this point to buttress my point. One day, a wealthy man, a wealthy man woke up one day and said, it is time for my daughter to get married. He has a pretty daughter. And the man happened to be the king of the community. That's a very beautiful daughter, and that's the only child. And this king is very wealthy. So he sent the town crier. And as the town crier to go to the village and announce to the abled young men in the community that on this so 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 day, I will give out my daughter's hand in marriage to the man who merits it. So anybody that desires to be my daughter's husband should be in my conference room or in, the, in my premises. So on that fateful day, everybody started gathering. All the young men in the community, the big, the small, the young, the old, they gathered together. You know, and the macho men were pushing others aside. Get out of the way. You think the, the lady will look at you? Come on, go, go and sit down. Look at you. you. You dwarf and you smallish man. You know, all manner of stuff was going on that day. So the king now said to them, 
You are welcome, my children. Today, the man who qualifies, who meets the criteria, will be my daughter's husband. Are you ready? And they said, yes, they are ready. Give us, tell us, what's the condition? And he took them to his backyard. And he showed them an Olympic-sized swimming pool. And said to them, whoever crosses can, that can swim across this swimming pool to the other side will be the guy that will marry my daughter. Immediately, the men were just about to. He said, wait, I need to show you something. He brought a live goat and threw it into the swimming pool. Two hefty crocodiles grabbed the, they grabbed the um, goats and tore it apart. And all the men started moving backwards. You need to see how the unprintable names they call that man, the king that day, wicked man, evil man, ritualist. You are looking for another person to sacrifice as gods. That's why you don't even have a son because you have sacrificed. They called him unprintable names. And while this was going on, suddenly they heard a sound in the swimming pool. Bam! Somebody, somebody was swimming. And this person swam across the other side of the pool. And everybody was screaming, screaming, screaming. Boom! He got to the other side and he was breathing. He was breathing heavily and everybody were shouting. They were screaming, chanting war song. And the king walked up to him and said, how did you do it? Congratulations. Tell me your name. And the young man kept his head down. He was breathing heavily. Heavily he was breathing. He said, king, Get out of my side. I'm not interested in your wealth. I'm not interested in marrying your daughter. He said, but you just did it. You just swam across the, uh, uh, the, the pool. He said, the only thing I'm interested in right now is who pushed me. Apparently, the young man did not jump into the pool with his right senses. Somebody pushed him. Somebody wanted to make him a scapegoat. but it ended up working in his favor. So I'm asking you today, who is pushing you? Who is pushing you to success? If nobody pushed him, he wouldn't have become who he is today. You need somebody to push you. Everybody needs someone to push him. Your friends could be that Telemundo you watch or that Z world you watch every day. The question is, is it pushing you to your destination? I see some persons, they, they spend a lot of time watching BB Niger. I'm not saying you should not relax. But who is pushing you? Who are your friends? Who are your friends? Who are your friends? Take a look at this picture. These are the click of billionaires. This picture was taken recently. When Ali Kodangote celebrated his salah in his yacht. These are his fellow billionaires. If you look, you'll see Otedola and the likes of them. They all celebrated salah on the sea. Who is pushing you? Who are you talking to? Who is your friend? Who speaks into your life? If you don't have anybody to push you, you need to pay the price to get someone to push you. Don't make friends who are comfortable to be with. Make friends who will force you to lever yourself up. Make friends to those who will push you out of where your comfort zone to start doing things differently. Make friends with those who will challenge your mind. Make friends with those who speak positively, not those who are looking for uh, opportunities uh, um, to fall upon them like a bag of sherry. Are, are you understanding what I'm saying? If you understand, please put it in the comment section. I want to read your comments. Make friends.
have um um what the, what who have targets these are, these are the things we want to achieve today who is speaking into your life your habits are the products of your relationships the relationship you have kept is as a result of the habits your friends determine your values your values determine your decision your decisions determine your actions your action determines your results now if your result is bad check your actions if your actions is bad check the decisions which you have taken if your de decisions are bad check the friends in your life now what you spend most of your time with can also be called your friends i spend a lot of time with my friends and my friends ranges from humans those who who think ahead those who also earn seven figures i spend a lot of time with my friends on my youtube i spend a lot of time with my friends on my books both the hard copies and the uh ebooks who are your friends who is pushing you your habits are the product of the relationships which you have kept who is your friend who is pushing you who is pushing you to success who is pushing you to get to the new next level in your destiny who is pushing you to get to the next level in your life you must get yourself acquainted with all these things so i want you to watch this video over and over again the replay is going to be available watch it share the link share the link with as many as possible i want so many persons to become millionaires so you need to change your decisions you want to be a millionaire you need to change your decisions it's very important it's very important so not change sorry you need to take a decision first decide to be the millionaire and you need to take the right actions after being after deciding to be a millionaire you need to take the right actions and you also need to stop taking bad financial advice don't take advice from those who are not yet millionaires, those who have not failed and succeed. There is what is called failing forward. Then you also, you, you, you must get out of one income stream. And it's also important that you get somebody to push you to become the millionaire you want. If you don't have anybody to push you, you will not become that millionaire which you desire. And that is where I'm going to end my trading for today. I appreciate you. I thank you for um, sticking out time with me today. I appreciate you for hanging out to learn from my wealth of knowledge. It's 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 my fun, pleasing pleasure and desire to be, or rather, um, it, it's my it's my sincere desire to see you hitting seven figures every month. From seven figures, you are moving to eight figures. It's very very important thank you for hanging out with me for this 58 minutes it's my pump pleasing pleasure and a privilege to be your host today i want to see you in my high income skill training starting tomorrow click um on the link or chat me up on whatsapp my whatsapp number is displayed here chat me up on whatsapp or click on the link in this video um to get into the uh high income skill training Chat me up on WhatsApp or the link I'm going to drop on my Facebook. Chat me up. Let's get started. It's important you learn how to make money with your smartphone. Thank you very much. I appreciate every one of you. I believe you got value. I believe you got something from this video. Uh, I want you to drop it in the comment section. What did you get? Which of the points resonates more with you? Which of the points do you love most? Like I said, my own is the number four point, um, not having one income stream. I hate uh, having one income stream. Okay, so I did several years back, I did everything possible to get out of the one income stream bottleneck. And I also want you to get to that place. Thank you and have a wonderful Saturday. Share this video, put up comments and have a great day. Bye.